everyone, this is the Fuzzy Slug again. Uh, I haven't made a tutorial in a while, so I figured why not make a tutorial uh, that's in most of my uh, videos you may see in the background. It is Placebo Effect for Windows 7. Basically, it's a uh, awesome theme for your Windows 7, like it will customize the taskbar, to customize the background, everything. This is a fresh install of Windows 7 Ultimate. I am on a virtual PC, not my actual PC, because I don't want to ruin it accidentally. And it won't ruin it, because you can create some backups for files, because we are going to be dealing with the System32 files. All I installed was Mozilla Firefox, so uh, basically fresh except for that. Uh, so the first thing you want to do, I'll put all the links in the description of the vid video. You want to go... Whoops, let's see what now. You want to go to deviantart.com. Basically, a uh, website where people post what they make, like uh, art and stuff like that, as you can see. So, we look up placebo for Windows 7. Okay, then look up placebo Windows 7. There we go. Here we go. So, you're going to want to dump... Oh, that's one thing I didn't figure out. You're going to need WinRAR, so I guess I'll put that in the description as well. I didn't think. So, let's do that real quick. So, we'll let this download. Uh, it won't affect it, because I'm just going to be installing WinRAR real quick that we're going to need. Okay, that's okay. Done. Okay, there we go. So that should be a RAR file once it's done. We're also going to need the uh, system files, which should be right here. Just click the link. And it should open Mediafire. Download it. Exit out of the uh, pop-up. Save file. There we go. So just wait for that to download. Both of them. And let's hope this changes back to a uh, RAR file like this. It is a .rar, but like I said, you're also going to need, uh, it will say right here, you're going to need Universal Theme Patcher, but this website is broken. So we're going to need to look it up. Universal Theme Patcher. Get this one, uh, the, mm, this one, uh, the load. I'll put this in the description as well. In full screen, it should be over here. And get the US one, unless you live in the UK or whatever. Wait three seconds while the rest. Ah, there we go, that one's done, and it did switch over to a RAR file. Okay, that's weird. Did it move over there, or what happened to it? Hmm. Here it is. Universal Theme Petra, and then Placebo System Files. So, now we're done with the web browser for now. I think we are done with it, period. Alright, uh, extract all of these. So, let it all process. Okay, and last but not least, the System Files. We're going to open up. Uh, Universal Theme Petra. Use the uh, you, if you have 32-bit, use 86. If you have 64-bit computer, use that one. Okay. Yes. Patch. Should say. Okay. There we go. Patch. And patch. Now what you want to do is restart your computer, as it says. So I will do that, and I'll be back with you guys in a moment. Okay, guys, uh, we're back. Uh, you may hear my family in the background. They just got back. Anyways, so uh, we installed the Universal Theme Patcher. So now we can put that in the recycle bin, and we can dispose of it because we don't need it anymore. So we're going to be needing the Placebo system files and Placebo. That's why we got it. So the first thing we want to do is go into Tools and go to Take Ownership and install it to the registry. Yes. Okay. Now that is done. You can select which uh, placebo you would like. I go for the cold light too because I personally like that one. So you just want to control C, copy it, and then go to run. Go to C colon backslash windows slash resources. And now that you're in here, go to themes and paste it in there. 
continue. And now that that's in there. Okay, so now we're done with that part. Now we can go into Explore Frame, Cold Light since I'm using it, 64 bit computer. We're going to want to go to C, uh, Run. We're going to want to go to C, Colm. <sighs> Can't type today. Colm backslash, C, Colm backslash, Windows, System 32. So now we'll be editing System 32 files. So this is the time where you can copy all the files in here that we're, we are editing. Like, uh, you go to Explorer Frame. Uh, go um, open file location. It would be right here. I would copy this, put it on a file on your desktop, uh, because we are going to be replacing that. So take ownership once you're ready, and it'll, it'll click yes, and it'll be ready. So d now drag this explore frame into here. Move and replace. Continue. And now that's in there. So now we can go back and see the next thing we have to do. We have to go into the system files, right here. Go to shell 32 cold light 64 okay shell 32 right click open file location and again take ownership yes and now drag this in here move and replace continue okay, now we're done with that one we can go to wimp block 64 bit and now we have two folders system 32 sys file 64 so so we do system 32 first since we're already in here so we just type that in, DLL, open file location, oh, take ownership, forgot about that. There we go. Drag it in here. Move and replace, continue. Yes. There we go. So now we will go to the SysWow64. Now we will go to web block again. Okay. Go to the open file location. Take ownership. Yes. Drag it in here. Move and replace. Continue. And now we should be done. Good to go. Yep. So now that we are done with that, we will restart our computer one more time. So I'll see you guys then. Hello guys, I am back. Again, you will hear my family in the background. I'm sorry for that. Anyways, uh, let's go into explosive mode. Anyways, uh, so we are back. Um... What you want to do now is right click your desktop, go to personalize, and you should see placebo cold light 2 here, or whatever uh, you installed. So click on it, and it should change now to the placebo cold light 2. And this is the new theme for your computer. Hope you guys liked it. Uh, that is all the steps you have to do. Uh, you now, well, Firefox has a little glitch with this at the top, this whole bar thing. Uh, I'm not so worried about that, as everything else is pretty cool. Oh, yes, 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 there's one more. I like changing my wallpaper to any of these that are in here. I like using that one. Sorry about that. I like using this one uh, because it matches sort of with all the uh, gray, uh, grayness, blackish. So, yeah, I hope you guys like this video. And uh, please comment, like, share, subscribe, dislike if you didn't like it. And now we can um, remove all these. Hmm. Uh, sorry about the background noise. That's my family back there. Sorry. Alright. Um, hope you guys liked the video. Goodbye.